Enterprise content management for IBM can solve many different business challenges. Today we will focus on the capabilities for advanced case management and how, when coupled with IBM Content Navigator, they can be used for new account openings within the healthcare industry. In today's video, Healthcare Services New Account Opening Solution has been enhanced to assess the applicant's care management needs. Carly Adams is a new account specialist responsible for opening the new account, while Dave Inman is a care manager working with targeted new members to improve their health and control costs. Behind the scenes, Paula Small, the business analyst, has redefined and enhanced the new account opening solution to include this assessment. We begin with Carly reviewing and validating the new applicant's identity prior to assessing the new applicants for additional care management programs. She then splits the case in order to complete the processing of the new account in a timely manner. Carly reviews her in basket and sees that several high priority new applicant work items await her action. Carly selects the first work item. Carly reviews the case information noting that no identification validation is included with this applicant. Prior to contacting the applicant to validate identity, Carly searches the Healthcare Services repository for identity information. Carly has completed an advanced search based on the applicant's social security number, and search results show that a driver's license for the applicant has been found in the repository. Carly adds the driver's license directly into the case file. We see that she has a wide range of additional actions that she could take in working with this document. Carly reviews the driver's license. Viewing capabilities enable her to annotate comments directly on the image. Upon completing identity validation, Carly was returned to her in-basket where, based on the new solution enhancements, she has received a new task to assess the applicant's care management needs. By using a locally generated form-driven checklist and defined business rules, applicant information has automatically been retrieved from the Healthcare Services Repository. This content has been used to generate an assessment of need. This information will be added to the case as supporting documentation and a care manager will be automatically assigned. With the assessment completed and reviewed, Carly adds a comment to the case documenting that the case will be split for processing. Splitting the case enables Carly to complete opening of the new account while initiating a new longer running case to assess additional care management needs for this new member. Carly reviews case content and selects to have these documents included in the newly created split case. Carly utilizes the case visualizer capability to review the status of her work activities and the opening of the new account. Carly does one final review of the case history and completes processing of the case. After ensuring identity validation, Carly completed a care management needs assessment for the new member and proceeded to split the case for the care manager. But how did she get here? Let's look at the business analyst Paula Small. Paula is responsible for the new account opening solution for healthcare services. As such, she has used IBM Case Builder to define the new account opening solution that is currently in place. With the new initiative to provide care management programs for its new members, she has enhanced the solution to include the assessment for care management needs. So let's see, at a high level, what she's done. To enhance the process, Paula selects the new account opening solution, one of the many case solutions that Healthcare Services has created. IBM Case Builder enables Paula to use a step-by-step -step approach to edit the solution. She can deploy and test her enhancements to a sandbox environment prior to handing it over for full deployment to a staging or production environment. IBM Case Builder provides tabs for each of the different parts of the solution. Tabs include properties, roles, in baskets, document types, pages, and case types. Paula defines and adds the new care manager role to the new account opening solution. One of the aspects of the design environment for IBM Case Builder is that Paula is able to define and customize a user interface based on user role. This enables her to maximize her knowledge worker's productivity. Here we see that specific properties have been added to the in-basket for the care manager. In completing her enhancements for the care management needs assessment, Paula has dynamically defined new business roles using straightforward if-then-else business logic as part of the process and workflow definition. By using the task manager, Paula is able to define and specify required and discretionary tasks that are part of the solution. Paula adds a new precondition, the applicant age, as part of the new task being defined. 
Here we can see that Paula has successfully added the newly required assess care management task as part of the solution. From here she has defined the workflow, properties, etc. associated with this new task, committed the changes, and proceeded with deployment. By using IBM Case Builder, Paula has implemented the enhancements required for the new account specialist to assess care management needs as part of the new account opening solution. So let's take a look at the care manager split case created earlier. Dave is an experienced care manager. He begins by reviewing new member information contained in the case or located in healthcare services repositories. Based on member discussion, he reviews supporting documentation in order to add new tasks required to meet new care needs. Upon completion, he processes updates to the case. Dave, using his iPad, sees a number of new work items awaiting his action. He opens the work item for Karen Grant, the new healthcare services member, which he received as part of the split case from the new account specialist. Upon opening the case, Dave sees a summary of case information and a set of documents which he will review. He starts with the checklist assessment document that was automatically added to the case. Dave completes a quick review of the Assess Care Management Needs checklist before proceeding. Prior to contacting the member, Dave initiates an advanced search for any related cases using member information to guide the search. Dave's search returns several related cases for this member. He reviews the case history for each of these related cases. Based on the wealth of member knowledge he has gained, Dave contacts the member and discovers the need for a cardiac assessment. Needing guidance for the cardiac assessment process, Dave searches for reference information stored within the Healthcare Services Repository, where various reference documents are organized and maintained. Dave locates the guideline document that has the information he needs. Directly from here he can perform many action items. He opens the documents to view the contents. Straight from within the web client, Dave views the document via the Zero Footprint Document Viewer without having to wait for download times or going through the process of getting additional software. Dave is able to get the information he needs straight from within the web client. Dave has completed his review of the cardiac assessment process guidelines and proceeds to add a new ad hoc task to request a cardiac assessment. Dave completes processing of this new task, assigning it to a cardiac specialist, and adds this task to the case. Prior to processing, Dave does a final review of the case via the History tab. He sees all the comments and actions, including the new ad hoc task, included as part of the case. He completes his review and completes processing. In today's video, we've seen how a new account specialist and a care manager used enhancements in the new account opening solution to increase their members' satisfaction and the impact on their business. For more information, please contact IBM. Thank you.